Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Detention. The creepy, creepy, creepy game on Steam. Um, so let's go and we are talking to our former self, where we can change between worlds. Uh, hang on, so this is... So we're back at the school. So we haven't, I haven't actually explored yet in this um, multiverse. The door is blocked by an unknown force. Okay. But we can't hold our breath, so I guess the enemies are gone. Someone there. The bonfire of hope is almost depleted, diminishing into the wind. Okay. Oh, this is a reading club. Some of the book contents might conflict with your everyday thoughts. But this material will help you engage in reflective and independent thinking. Well, let's call it a day, shall we? I do want to remind you all again to never mention the book club to anyone else. For that might put yourself and others in great danger. And way, I'd like to ask you a favour. Yes, Miss Yin, is it about the new books? I've already given the list to Mr. Chang. He said the shipping company won't help us out anymore, but he'll figure something out. The government is enforcing restrictions on all imports. Soon the big, soon the book club might come to an end. Why are there things like this? I'm sorry, Wave, there's nothing I can do either. Just one more thing. Mr. Chang never brought us any of his books in the first place, right? I know I can always count on you. Okay. So, the book club was reading material. Wait, what? Half a century in exile, blacklisted to return home for burial. During the period of martial law, Miss Yin Tzu Han was a wanted political fugitive. She was lucky to evade arrest and left the country only to be blacklisted. She travelled the world fighting for human rights and freedom of expression, but unfortunately died of lung cancer at the age of 50. Her last wish was to be able to return to her hometown. Now this wish can be achieved with the lift... The bit type of air, that's fine. Lifting of martial law. Okay. So, I guess that's all for that room. I know, I got a feeling this is just kind of filling out the story a little bit. Creepy bow. It's a very cool, um, very cool filter, I guess. Filter's the right word. Oh, hello. The way forward is the path to your past. However, the road ahead has crumbled. Lead me anywhere and I will follow you like a shadow. Okay. So I'm assuming there's probably puzzle solving that you've got to do in between the two worlds. Um, it seems that that is all that we can do with this young lady in this realm. This room. This was. So let's go here in the creepy when I'm a ghost. Although, no, that's the only... Because everywhere else was locked, so I have to talk to her. And I have to do something... ...in the other realm, so... Let's 
this puts me out here. So there's nowhere else I don't think I can go. Except for the bathroom, which has got some... Unless I can go, because that's locked by some force. Maybe if I can go and be the other person and then come... And go into the other realm, the past, I think. Uh, and then that way I can go through the door? Maybe? We'll see. Oh, okay. Interesting. The sliding door is wrapped in barbed wire. What sliding door? Can't open this door. Okay. It's not creepy or anything. Okay, alright, so I guess that was just leading her across, and then I can go back, I guess. Go through here. Hmm, okay. Is she gonna follow me though? Hmm. Maybe I've gotta go all the way around? I can go down, so maybe I've got to go all the way around. It's a bit grim, a bit creepy. Who can be calling in a time like this? Okay, so that's... That was shit I was doing beforehand. I feel. So if I walk around here, then she should be here, and then I can talk to her. Remember when you enrolled? So full of passion. Participating in every school activity, showing off your academic abilities, grabbing the attention of your peers and teachers. Then things took a turn for the worse at home. Well, the intention quickly turned into unwanted scrutiny. So you chose... Uh, to escape. The world is immeasurably vast. There is always a place to hide. You are me. Alright. It's grim, but that's alright. This place is completely lifeless. Even ideas are buried here. Oh, they're burning the books. Remember to thoroughly destroy each book and add the spirit money to throw them off. There can't be any intact book pages or else this would be for naught. Yeah, so they've been caught. Hey, they? You're close with Miss Yin. I have actually had to flee the country overnight, is that true? I'm not sure, she never said anything about leaving. Unlike Miss Hume, we don't have the connections to guide us to safety. Aren't you afraid? Well, actually, what bothers me the most is, do you know how the leading risk got leaked out? Stop asking questions. I'm as clueless as you. Let's just hurry up and finish. We don't want to get caught. Yeah. So they were... they got caught reading the prohibited list of books. What do we have here? A written verdict from court. Shang Ming Hoi, district level educator, is found guilty with students, they and others, of collusion with communist forces. Shang Ming Hoi is to be put to death after the court ruling. Wei Chong Ting pleads guilty to affiliation with communist forces. Reading of prohibited texts with rebellious and corrupt force will be sentenced to 15 years jail time. Okay. So, was that. Was Wei. When we saw him in school, was that before everything happened? 
swimming you went in. Yeah. Uh oh. This isn't gonna go well. Door is barred by a room. There's a note on top of it. Snitcher. Sure. Oh. Okay. Shit's getting warped now. Oh, the music room. Time in fear, forcing herself to breed hatred. Who knew that she would take that leap and leave this world behind? Nary a last word, because of fear, remorse? The reason remains undecided. I was left with a blur of confused thoughts, spiralling through my mind. When I saw the sunlight again, things had changed drastically. My loved ones and teacher went to a higher place. She was buried in an unmarked grave, leaving me a decrepit man. Okay. There's lots of shit going down. So, I guess that just leaves, there's a projection room next door, I think. Which I'll assume is where it would be leading me. Oh, no, save. I feel blessed. Nothing else there, okay. We must be getting close to the end, it feels very climactic. Oh, hang on. That's not the same as it was. There's a note on the cart. Yes, yes. So that, that's remnants of the past. What do we have here? This is the... Hmm. Okay, so I guess I've got to turn, turn this one off and then acting immediately on one's determination. This is the philosophy he believed in, but someone should take fate into their own hands. With you following him, what ideas do you hold? take hold of your destiny but it's a charming thought so life has gained a goal next to him you found yourself you are me I'm not quite sure what all this philosophical stuff is supposed to be it's a bit too I don't know I don't, I don't know I, I will see how it unravels but no matter how many times this replays, nothing can be unwound. You can never redeem yourself. That's me, isn't it? Instructed by. Oh, I ratted them out. This is the book list I mentioned before. I found it on our teacher's desk. She was the one. Miss Fang, the country appreciates your assistance. She was the one that rutted them all out. Snitches get stitches. Did you think finding something to rely on would stave off your fear? One day, however, he was gone, just like that. 
You've lost everything. You can depend on what choice will make will you make now. Uh, you can depend on, try to take them back, I guess. The instructor's sharp gaze was stifling. You steeled yourself and performed without hesitation. In that one moment, transforming into a pitiless patriot. Easier than you think, right? You are me. Yeah, okay. Alright, we'll just keep going through the motions. So, she was the one that handed the book list, which caught everyone in trouble, and the teacher had to flee the country. Um, um, please don't tell me this is just going to end, because she just jumps off the... Uh, What point are you trying to make? Yellowed paper plane. Yellowed. Why is it yellowed? I guess we gotta go down. Open the door. Chang Min Hoi, you are suspected of spreading anti-government propaganda, smuggling banned books and organising illegal gatherings. The court has already obtained the necessary evidence. We now arrest you on the grounds of rebellious activities. Do not resist on pain of death. Looks like it will be difficult to escape this time. Fine. Take my head so that I may join my brothers and sisters in death. Sigh. Sorry. <sighs> Why? Aren't people born to live freely? To think openly, to speak their minds without restriction or fear. Freedom of belief, freedom of love, and self-realization. Being with you was a happiness of the simplest and purest kind. I couldn't help but think. When we could be hand in hand, living an untroubled life. But in the end, this is only a fool's dream. I'm... I too am vain like the daffodils, fixated on my grandeur. grandeur. Oh, the world is not ready for the likes of us. Sorry, I couldn't read that quick. Is that it? That's it, isn't it? That's it. Daffodils died by the river of crimson blood. Decaying rust like into the void. that way after all these years possibly because I mean it looks quite dilapidated
barred from the heavens and hampered from the underworld. Who is that lady? Alone and wandering forever she goes. Hmm. Yeah, there you go. So it's why after he's been um, pardoned. The large tree's been cut down. So why he's visiting the school basically. Reflecting, I guess. And there you go. That's this this the end. Neat way to uh, do the credits as well. It's a neat little game, actually, because it, it like it's a horror game, but actually. Ha is trying to illustrate a point, I guess, of, you know, you shouldn't have to live in fear of, of how you feel and, you know, and I guess it's, it's based on, um, the developers' own experiences, I'd imagine. I'd have to do some research, but, yeah. I, I don't think people should be afraid of, uh, is that a dick butt I see? <laughs> That is a dick bar, I see. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, oh, I guess it's graffiti, isn't it? But yeah, you shouldn't you shouldn't feel afraid to say what you think. I mean, obviously, you shouldn't go and in, incite hatred on people, and you know, and probably the relationship between the teacher and the student probably would be a little bit iffy. But you know, it's you it made a good point. Um, I guess this is his classroom. that little communication they had when she flashed forward I think it's like don't you don't you realize what you've done oh. no that was good it, it was um it was really good that was really really enjoyable I, I, will, I honestly did not expect to enjoy that as much as I did uh, the scariness at the start was actually really well done it was very creepy and very disturbing um, and then you kind of gather that it's more just her own inner demons was my understanding of it haunting her of what she done because she felt guilty um, cause she basically pushed everyone she loved away um, I, I'm not sure whether because I think there's different endings as well so I think I might have gotten the bad ending maybe but, I don't know. but anyway if you like this video please hit the like button below if you want to subscribe to see some more game gym material um, please hit the subscribe button. And as always, until next time, this is the Game Jam, signing out.